Hi, I'm Anthony Santoro, and I'm a turtle ecologist at the Harry Butler Institute at Murdoch University and the project lead for saving our snake neck turtle. And today I'm going to tell you all about the turtles, why they're cool, and why they need our help. So the southwestern snake neck turtles are also known as oblong turtles, and they only occur right here in the southwest of WA throughout the whole world. So that means they're endemic. So the turtles are really important in our aquatic ecosystems because they're the top predator and they keep a lot of the lower populations in check. So like mosquitoes, midges, they also eat fish, uh, some crayfish, frogs, tadpoles. And importantly, they're actually the kind of cleanup crews of the wetland. So they scavenge on a lot of animals that die to carry on. So by eating that, they remove it from the system and it keeps our water quality really nice. Unfortunately for the turtle, they're threatened by a number of things, including habitat loss, which is driven by climate drying, so the wetlands are drying up, as well as urbanization, where we fill in or modify wetlands for human needs. They're also threatened by predation, by things such as the invasive red fox, as well as the native ravens. So both these species predate on the adults, the females, when they come out on land and nest, as well as the nests themselves. When we go out and do population surveys, most of the time we're only catching adults but just because there aren't any juveniles making it back into the population. So what can you do to help these turtles? The number one thing would be to join citizen science projects and use the Turtle Sap app which then you can record where and when you see these turtles as if they're live dead as well as their nests which really helps scientists like us. You could also slow down while driving around wetlands especially during the spring when these turtles are out nesting as well as keeping your dogs on leads. Dogs can also be a problem when they interfere with the nesting turtles.